Hello, it's me, Jesse. My intros are getting more and more awkward, but I hope you guys are having a great day. Nike invited me to go all the way out to China, so big thank you to them. And I'm gonna have two vlogs coming up. One is gonna have all the Nike stuff. We hoots with people in China. Nike unveiled some new products. I'm gonna have a vlog with all of that coming out next, but this vlog is kind of all the things I did while we weren't doing that kind of stuff. And I had a mission. I heard you could buy fake designer clothing and stuff in China and just like, on side streets and stuff, and that is gonna be my goal. My goal is to find some fake designer clothing. With that being said, let's go to China. Also, if you're not subscribed, you have five seconds to subscribe, or bad luck is coming to you in the near future. That's a lot of pressure. Okay, let's go to China. Bye. 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 Ah! Bye. 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 Thank, Thank you so much. You. Much appreciated. I'm rich boys. <laughs> I spend about $50,000 every year on rubber bands, specifically just to hold my massive stacks of money. YouTube. So I just transferred $1,000 US and I got 5,800 UN. It turns out I got finessed because I got 5,800 when in reality I probably should have gotten what it's actually worth, 7,000. I got finessed. I'm sad. I'm a sad boy. It's okay. I think I'll be able to get a ton of stuff with this. We're saving money out here. We're thinking ahead. Saving money out here. This is unacceptable. Take a look to my right. They are trying to get me. Last minute, they know I'm leaving. This is their last second deploy to get me to buy some Gucci. But not today. You know what I say? Yeah. Not today, Gucci. Kenny's coming along for the adventure. My man is gonna help me translate. Hey man, hey. I, I grew up speaking Chinese my whole life. I'm a little intermediate, so if we get stuck on the streets in China, I can get us back home. Yeah, you know you're gonna saying? save yeah. him. Personally, I took three years of Chinese in high school. Shout out to Miss Chung, my Chinese teacher. She's gonna be proud of me for going to China. I retained about five words. <laughs> Only reason I took Chinese for three years it was the easiest class in the entire school. We had this old Chinese teacher, and she was the most chill teacher ever. Like, I didn't have to learn anything to pass and get A's and B's. So, like, half our grade was going to an extra credit assignment and watching a festival. Unfortunately, I didn't learn anything, so I'm kind of screwed, but I have Kenny to translate for me. But shout out to Miss Chung, I love you. It's time to prove myself. Your boy is in the plane. Is this a little footrest? No. This is godly, bro. This is actually god tier, right? <laughs> the flight is about 13 hours. <laughs> I'm, that's very intimidating. I had a great night's sleep last night, so I'm not tired at all, I'm gonna be honest. Complimentary gummy bears are already there. <laughs> I'm not gonna eat those. It's time to make myself at home. Dude is taking advantage of the outlets right now. Take not everyone's gonna them. use their outlets, so <laughs> I'll use it for them. So. Oh, wow. Cash is here too. So what's powerful. good, brother? Yo, what's good, man? What's Plane experience number one. We haven't even left yet. They brought me a hot towel. What is this for? Um, <laughs> what am I supposed to do with this? You gotta clean your face. Clean your face. Is my face it? Ooh. That's actually nice! We have made it to Beijing. <laughs> this is trippy. We left 2 o'clock on the 6th. Today is 6 o'clock on the 7th. We time traveled one day into the future, but we're here, man. And we are at the hotel. I'm staying at the Intercontinental. This is a five-star hotel. I don't deserve to be here, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> Welcome to my mini castle. Come in, come in, come in, come in, come in. First of all, these floors are very nice, very nice floors. And then we walk straight into the bathroom. A little unconventional, but it works, it works. First of all, we're gonna give you a full tour. We have the shower, very nice. And then next to that, we got the room where the massives are taken. Okay, perfect. There is a scale. I always have to weigh myself. 84 pounds, I've been losing weight, boys. You doubt me and see what happened. There's a massive bathtub. Every time I go to a hotel, I have a weird thing where I'm like, I have to try the bathtub. The bathtub at my home is kind of small, but this bathtub is one of the most massive bathtubs I've ever sat in. So I'm so excited to take a bath in here, you have no idea. You just see the room already. Look at the bed. Oh my god, this is the coolest hotel room I have ever stayed in. Snacks. Some snacks right here. This is the view. 
I really can't believe I'm in China, guys. I don't know what is my life. I don't know how I ended up here, but I'm very thankful. Thank you to you guys for watching, giving me a career in YouTube and allowing me to do amazing things like this, but yeah, this is really mad. I even got my own couch. In case the homies come over, wake up, it comes with slippers. I'm taking these home. <laughs> we got two bathrobes from once I get out of the bath. I can come out looking very, very nice, very sexy. In case the air pollution gets bad, it looks like I can pop open a mask. It has that, a little intimidating. And yeah, this is my room. It's ridiculous. Keep the menu. It literally lights up. I have never seen this before. Yeet, yeet. <laughs> Baby pigeon, right. suckling Are pig. I got the braised short ribs. Don't put the S. Don't put the S. Don't put the S. The S was for singular rib. <laughs> but this looks delicious. I'm about to dig in, and I got some carrots. It's a new day, it's a new dawn. Hello party people. Good morning everyone. Let's get some waffles. These are not waffles, waffles. I found my waffles so I am very happy right now. This is what I'm working with. I got a donut, I love donuts. Hash brown, apparently this is a pumpkin pie. Waffles, some fried rice and some bacon. <laughs> You guys watching? Yes. You, know, like, you, you won't find any fans out here because YouTube is bad. You know? <laughs> How do you guys watch? Eh. Best confidential. Don't sell anyone. I'm in the Nike store right now. The jersey that just got released literally today is out right now. I had to cop one because it is limited, and I feel like it's just sick having a China jersey. I have a Yao Ming jersey back at home, and I'm trying to get my jersey collection even better, so I had to cop that. They have a Simpson store. I don't really need any Simpsons stuff, but it, the fact that they just have one is really cool. Everyone is staring at me. <laughs> These shoes aren't released in America yet, and they have them here. Should I cop? I don't think I'm gonna cop, but they are sick. We're at McDonald's. Apparently it's a lot different here, so we'll, let's just see what's popping. I probably should have selected my language. <laughs> I'm guessing this is go back. Is it always the thick Angus beef burger, or is it just Angus beef burger back home? I don't know. <laughs> They have buckets of chicken. They don't have that home. They definitely don't have that back home. That looks delicious. Why are there sausages on that? What? German sausage double beef. That's OD, bro. Bro, they even have double, double filet fish. We only have one. And that's what Mopey would order. <laughs> We're on a time restriction, so. I'm not getting any McDonald's today. We got a Starbucks. Quick side note, the buildings are kind of ridiculous here. The architecture for a lot of these buildings is really cool. I gotta show you guys more buildings. <laughs> All right, I'm back. This is what I caught. I got the Team China jersey and the shorts to go with it. I gotta wrap the full outfit, man. I have to. It's literally only available here and it's limited, so I'm really glad I got it. Okay, okay, what y'all thinking? Do I look good? Do I look like I can play for Team China? Definitely not, but I I like the fit, bro. Uh, should I wear this? We're about to go out and do some more stuff. Should I just rock the full Team China set? Ah! Cool building alert, giving it an 8 out of 10. Actually, I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10. I realized it is a lot bigger. I thought it was just that, but we have all of this. Apparently, this building is actually a mall. That is one of the largest malls. <laughs> the building I gave an 8, I'm now inside of it. Um, this wasn't expected, but we ended up going here. We're waiting to go to a concert. It doesn't start for like an hour. I don't have much details. It should be wild. Damn, bro. I don't know how I'm supposed to find anything when it's five stories, six stories tall. I don't know where to go. What in the world is this fruit? It's durian. You've had this? Is it good? Ooh, this is the inside. The Supremes are right here. I don't know if I should call. I don't know if they have my size. They go hard? Supremes. We are leaving the mall. We explored probably 3% of it. I didn't end up copping the Supremes. You know what? I might have to go back for them, bro. They were kind of fire. <laughs> we're out here right now. We're going to be checking out the Forbidden City. I got this thing in my ear, so everything she says I can hear. She's our tour guide. Apparently, the Forbidden City is about to be 600 years old. We're about to go inside. And also, a lot of people are staring at me. They think I'm Tyler Hero. I know. This dude's fishing pole. Oh, 
is on a whole nother level. That is goaded, bro. If I start fishing, I definitely need to get me one of those. Look at these things. Damn. We're about to enter the Forbidden City and oh my god, there is so many people! My self-confidence is feeling good. I'm one of the tallest people here. <laughs> I'm feeling good. People keep trying to be slick and take pictures of us, specifically Chris. We see them. <laughs> They're not slick. Everyone is like just staring. How do you yeah. feel? Do you feel really weird right now? Not really. You're used to it? I'm a little used to it, but not on this like scale. <laughs> Tour guide said the reason there's no trees here is because the emperor didn't want the trees to be taller than his buildings. She said the mythical animals right here, um, when it rains, water shoots out of them. That's pretty cool. Really, real talk, shout out to all the people who built this because the craftsmanship just, this is like some of the coolest architecture I've ever seen in my life. Anybody wore the color yellow, so yeah. basically she said I wouldn't be beheaded because I got yellow patch. What? Yeah, and also she said if any trees was higher than his building, he would it kill the tree. He has short man syndrome. <laughs> short man syndrome. <laughs> she. Try, try, try. I'm glad I was born in the 2000s. I'm just gonna say that. It's just uh, the emperor sometimes looks small and short. But, um, would he get mad if there was really tall people? No, no, okay. no. Because he has bodyguards. He had bodyguards, of course, taller and bigger than he. The color of yellow could only be used by the emperor. So you have some. Little bit yellow hair. He has all yellow hair. So Maybe with yellow. <laughs> I have yellow hair. I wow. have not. Yeah. We're gone. We're dead. Wow. Who would be beheaded? Yeah, if 500 years ago. LSK is worldwide out here. <laughs> <laughs> Too high. <hype. laughs> Bucket squad in the building. <laughs> We're taking a break at the Starbucks right now, and look at this Starbucks. This is what the Starbucks is looking like right here. That's pretty insane. You're like, wow, this Starbucks is probably massive. Hold up. It goes upstairs. <laughs> I, I didn't get anything. I don't really drink coffee. I just got a water. This is the second floor. They have like the cold drinks, the fruity drinks over here. It looks so nice. There it is, the Starbucks logo. Then we go to the third floor. The third floor of this Starbucks is literally a bar. I didn't know that was a thing, but apparently it is, and that's pretty sick. <laughs> I found some Gucci. I found some Gucci. Can I, how much is this? Uh, 280. 280? I'll buy this. I finally found it. I finally found the fake designer. <laughs> I'm gonna get both of these. There's some nice bags. I'm gonna get these three. How much is all this? Uh, 280 each. Yeah, 600. 600? Yeah. What is that? 800? It, it, it was 600 yuan. And that is about 600. 100, 120 dollars, maybe? Right? Out here saving. That's how you save money, boys. Thank you for the bags. Fish it. Finally, yes! The bag has been secured. My, my mission has been completed. I came here with a goal. And the goal has been completed. The bag is secured, boys. We're saving money out here. <laughs> I'm so happy. Shout out to the man right here. He brought down the price 300 UN. Full bargaining skills, my guy, the MVP. Oh, man, you watching? Yeah, that's Chris right there. Oh, that's Chris, yeah. good. Who's that? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, irrelevant. <laughs> Do you know Mopey? Oh, Man. get your irrelevant ass out of here, boy. <laughs> We're in a secret shop right now, Soul Stage. I just caught some off-white. I'm flexing. I got a little off-white shoe keychain to put on my, my car keys. You can open up the flaps, like the actual off-white shoe. I see an off-white store. I've never actually seen an off-white store before. I know the mission was to cop fake designer, but I've always wanted an off-white hoodie. The look at this one, and I like the back, too. Going to cop this bad boy. What it do, baby? 
What's good? I came here with a goal. I wanted to find some fake designer, and I found it. So we got we got the GD Gucci right here. Look at the gold, man. 14 karat, authentic, you know what I'm saying? Dude, it, it's extremely fake. <laughs> like, you can literally, literally says GD instead of GG. Got some of the straps inside of it, or maybe it's a Gucci belt? You never know. Bag number one, my least favorite. On to bag number two, another GD Gucci. This one says, is that, that's low key a C, bro. That's a CG. <laughs> but we got the nice red, red bottoms, you know what I'm saying? It's fancy, little pocket right here, okay. But yeah, bro, it's so fake. <laughs> it's so fake. If someone doesn't know designer, bro, I feel like this could pass. And then, my favorite bag. The MCM bag, otherwise known as the mom bag. I might have to give this to my mother. Bro, it literally says mom. <laughs> <laughs> this is kind of a flex, bro. I'd rather wear something that says mom than MCM. It does say MCM right here, but bro, the mom bag is kind of a flex. I feel like it's kind of smaller too than like a regular one, but I, I could be wrong. Shout out to my boy. He lowered the price for me. Unfortunately, I wanted to do more shopping trying to get more pieces, but we were really limited on time. Had a pretty packed schedule. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I've had a blast out here. If you're not already subscribed, yo, make sure to subscribe to the channel, please. I beg, yo, subscribe. It means a lot if you if you enjoy it. If not, don't subscribe because you probably won't enjoy the rest of the content. Uh, <laughs> a few other videos are popping up right now. I'm gonna have one more video from China where we played uh, pickup games against different people and a bunch of different Nike stuff. So make sure to stay tuned for that. I'll see you guys later and peace.